Hey what's up guys welcome back to another Lightroom mobile tutorial so in today's video I'm going to show you guys how to edit your photos in a moody style so if that sounds good let's hop into this video Alright guys so this is the photo that we're working with today so let's hop into this so first of all we're going to take the exposure to around 30 I'm going to leave mine at 35 and we're going to move the contrast to 16 16 good then we're going to take the highlights down to minus 7 then we're going to take the shadows up to around 22 all right 22 23 22 all right so for the blacks we're going to take them down to around minus 9 Okay, now we're gonna head to the curve panel and all you have to do is mimic this curve so just pause the video and try and replicate this curve as much as possible we're not gonna deal with the red red uh, green and blue curves we're just dealing with the regular one today um, so you're just gonna take the whites and raise them up just a little we're gonna move the mid tones to the right slightly and you're going to move the blacks to the right slightly right so once you're done with this click done and we move to the color panel right so for the temperature i'll just say move it to a point that looks normal a point that you're comfortable with right you don't want it to look too cold or too warm so 5300 for me looks good for this picture right so for the tint we're going to move it to around 14. then for the vibrance we're going to take it up to around 22. 22 and then for the saturation we're going to take it all the way down to minus 25. Okay, then we're going to move to the mix panel. So we're going to start with red. So for red, we're going to take the hue to minus 38. Minus 38. Good. Then we're going to move to orange. So for orange, we're going to take the hue to minus 10. Minus 10. Good. We're going to take the saturation to 5. And we're going to take the luminance to minus 25. Okay, minus 25, good, minus 25, 26, okay. Then we're going to move to yellow. So for the suggestion of yellow, we're going to take it all the way down to around minus 70. Minus 70, good. Then for the luminance of yellow, we're going to take it down to around minus 9. Nine, that's fine then we're going to move to green so for the hue of green we're going to take all the way up to 100 all the way to 100 all right now you can see the make the difference it creates a huge difference in the color of like your plants around me i'm going to take all the way to 100 right then the saturation we're going to take it down to around minus 53 minus 53 then we're going to take the luminance down to minus 100 100 but I'm just gonna play with this a little bit maybe not minus 100 but it really depends on your preference but I'm gonna leave mine around let me say minus 19 I'm gonna leave mine at minus 19 I decided to change change my mind here then we're done with the color panel so we're gonna click on done and then we're going to move to the gradient panel. So for the shadows, we're going to move the hue to 27. And we're going to move the saturation to 8. So you can pause the video here and take your time and try and nail these figures. Hue 27, saturation 8. And this is for the shadows. So that's all we're dealing with here in the gradient panel. You're going to click on done. And we're going to move to the effects panel. So for the clarity, I'm going to move mine to around... Uh, I'm just playing here. I'm going to take mine to around 45. All right okay let's see let's see then i'm going to take the noise reduction to around 26 so detail noise reduction 26 is already there and we're done so i'm going to copy this i'm going to copy this preset and paste it on another photo so you guys can see the difference but before we do that, let's see the before and after this photo this is before and this is after this is before and this is after so now i'm going to copy this copy settings yes 
and I'm going to paste it on another photo that I have here. I'm going to pick this one and I'm going to paste the settings. Mr. Profile. Okay. So you can see that the the settings don't exactly match this photo because this photo is uh, brighter than the previous one so I'm just gonna adjust a few things but for the most part the preset works right I'm just gonna make a few adjustments so presets are never perfect right presets fit certain pictures but you can always adjust the basic settings to make it fit the majority of pictures that you have right so for like the previous picture that we just worked on it was more of a moody photo it was a dark photo and this one is a brighter photo so I'm just gonna adjust the basic things like the brightness the white uh, blacks, the highlights and the shadows so you can match this so for this I'm going to take the whites down to around like minus 43 um, let me play with the blacks here and leave the blacks around minus 7 uh, the shadows this this is moody photo, I'm going to leave the shadows around plus 24 um, for the exposure, let's see yeah, around 0 0.06 is fine you can see that I've successfully transferred this preset to another picture. So let's look at the before and after for this one. So this is before and this is after, this is before and this is after. Guys, click on this video to learn how to edit your pictures like Kanye West. But before you do that, don't forget to leave a like down below. Don't forget to comment, don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to share the channel, guys, and I'll see you in this video.